on to the video guys check this out this is my little garden update video and uh yeah here we so my wasabis are cranking in these absolutely cranking my um mate that i've met off youtube yeah, he knows who he is um fucking great guy always fucking gives me stuff he's made me a um, fishing rod uh slingshot fuck just a soul of the earth guy you know um and i'm sorry i haven't got back to you mate i, I will email you back again i'm just a uh, fucking sometimes you know when you just don't want to do anything anymore and you just you leave things that shouldn't be left even bills and shit you just don't want to deal with anything but yeah we're all good but uh, yeah anyway bro everyone it's in there folks i'm just going to take you through my garden it's about time i did a little video so i thought might as well show you my garden i've been pumping along i've been hammering it and um yeah it's just what i've been keeping myself busy with so um yeah come out and have a look so wasabi still going strong beautiful cranking um i got my bonsai tree here that my bro alan gave me a pot for so i'm still working on that hey bro i haven't forgotten about you either bro i haven't forgotten about everyone there's a lot of people that have been messaging me and stuff guys i just i'm just um yeah i'm just going through a bit of a tough time at the moment so i just yeah it's all i want to say but um yeah so a lot of i just just uh yeah just need some time to think there's a lot of things going a lot of people messaging me a lot of work things busy everything's busy everything's just crazy and um and yeah all aspects of my life at the moment just seem to be crazy but i'm working through that guys so we we aren't we aren't but i just want to show you me garden and what i've been working on to get yourself busy still got old mate here cruising along but yeah okay so over here my friends studio divas wasabi thank you brother if you ever watch this bark man mean as bro much appreciated so yeah that's that's the wasabi so it's cranking i think i've got it sussed now i've actually got it sussed i've taken heaps of cuttings off this one so that's what yeah absolutely flourishing i've got a blueberry cutting that i've got off one of my blueberries yeah as i say um and here is a that is a pawpaw show you the rest Hey guys, we've got a black currant here. So that's a black currant. It's cranking at the moment, that blackberry. No, that's a raspberry actually, sorry. That's a raspberry. No, that's a red currant. That's a red currant. That one here is a raspberry. Got a Logan berry in there, and that's ready for watermelons. The rest of this. Blackberry I got from the train tracks. Um where I used to work at the Kiwi Fruit Orchard, raspberry popping up, raspberry popping up, that doubled inside and then grew into the ground and then I cut in half, so now I've got two. That just thing won't stop growing, but it, it was diseased and I cut it right back. Now it is thriving. And raspberries, pumping this year's raspberry crop. This is two and a half, three-year-old raspberry crop. So yeah, oh, that one's not doing so well. So yeah, it's not good. We don't want that. Let's have a look. Yeah, shit. Take that off. Try and let that. Just pull those off and let that um. Let it try and heal itself. I don't know what's going on there. But, oh yes, I'm fucking dying too. Oh shit, that's not a good sign. But yeah, I'll rip that off. But anyway. We've got cranking raspberries here. They're starting to pump. Raspberries are going everywhere. Uh, my brother got this from his wood yard. This is a crazy blackberry. Yeah, she's crazy, going crazy. And then they've got a raspberry coming out there too. I think I think that's a raspberry. They just they just come from here. It might even be that blackberry actually. No, actually, I think it's that blackberry. And then behind that, I've got my blueberries. So these, my babies, I've been going hard on these. Oh, it's so hard, guys. To, they need um, lots of uh, sulfuric, uh, acidic, acidic fuel, uh, fuel, dirt, and um, so I have been giving it sulfur mixes every four weeks. And fuck, this thing here is just cranking this blueberry. 
that's a different one to the rest of them all. But yeah, um, there's two Fijoas there. There's another blueberry there. This one here had heaps of blueberries on it, but I transferred it into a, um, that was, it had that pot, that small pot. Then I bought a big one, and when I transferred it, it just dropped all its, they don't like being transferred, eh? And it's taken, still taken ages to try and get its, its leaves on. Uh, this here is a Caraca blackberry. So this is a Caraca. These are massive blackberries. They're like that long. So yeah, those ones there will be a small blackberry. Uh, so I've got one, two, three of those. And then the rest of those are boysenberries. I think a Loganberry. Uh, blackberry, but this one is a... It's a... Um, thorn-free one. So yeah, it's got no spikes on it. So that'll be quite cool. So hopefully that comes up. But yeah, as you see, the rest of them have heaps of spikes on them, eh? But yeah, that one there. She's a thornless, that's what they call her. So yeah. And then, um, yeah, so we've got uh, Loganberries, Boysenberries all around there. And I think that's another one. I got these cuttings for like three bucks for like five of them. Or six or seven or something. I just had a massive... And then I got for four bucks, I think, I got some elderberry plants so i've got these elderberries and these are growing in here um this is another uh logan berry that i there's some more over there they're all just i just got so many of these berries now i'm a bit confused of what ones are what i got boys and berries logan berries i know the blackberries well, i know all the blackberries i'm just confused about the logan berries and the boys and berries and um but not the elderberry there so that's so i got heaps of cuttings of the elderberry they're cranking at the moment they just be they were just stalks and so um yeah i got those so come over here with me now team and um oh, i'll tell you my my mate alan he knows who he is um that is lemon balm and i've kept that f since he gave it to me and it's just f that thing's mean i have lemon balm teas i love that thing it's mean look beautiful sunset tonight beautiful sunset guys this one here is my lemonade tree, so it's a cross between a lemon and a kind of an orange, but it's just a sweet lemon, really good. So two lemonade trees, bloody great. Yeah, get heaps of lemonades off those. So yeah, we come through here. I got a, a vanilla bean tree, kind of this apparently. This in here, it um, gives off a vanilla bean seed and you scrape it out and it's apparently like ice cream but fuck i've been growing this for like 10 years and it's never given me anything so yeah i don't know then i've got my two elderberries in the ground here and they're flourishing that way better than the ones in the plant thank you come here you've got a sunflower over there oh yeah there's some really good elderberry there so hopefully those two elderberries we're gonna get a little uh Harvest and really, really healthy for you, eh? Oh, yep, there's my girl. Make sure she's someday. So, yeah, I've been cranking. Every day I come out here and I water my plants. And um, I'm using uh, organic seafood, uh, seaweed. And then I've got this, this baby here, this tank. Oh yeah, she's low. Oh, anyway, that's about there. Anyway, it's probably a bit way past that. But yeah, there's the... I had a whole... Um, I made a whole sprinkler system in there, but I probably chopped it in half the other week down there, so... I um, need to reinstate that irrigation. There's Crookie Bird. 